In this video, I would like to show you how to make a macOS app from iOS mobile app. Here I am using macOS Catalina 10.15.5 version. So you, you must have at least this version to do this project. Alright, let's get into it. First of all, I am searching for my Xcode, so command space and searching for my Xcode right here and create a new project, Xcode project and it will be uh, of iOS application and it's single view alright I'm clicking next I'm going to name it as Mac OS and uh, the language is Swift user interface is Storyboard alright next let's name a uh, Mac OS sample right then I'm creating this file my iOS projects alright First of all, what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete the scene delegate. I'm not going to use Swift UI in this project. I'm going to use the storyboard, right? So I'm deleting the scene delegate. I'm going to this uh, info.playlist and deleting this application scene manifest as well. And uh, I'm going to my app delegate and deleting these all steps. And just type it as war window UI window. All right, that's ready. I'm going to my main dot storyboard. My view controller with iPhone 11 user interface. This is an initialization. All right, let's go to assets dot sc file. I'm dropping a football from my system to this assets. All right. So I have given this image in my uh, video description you can just download it and uh, drop it in assets or else you can use some other kind of image from your system as well doesn't matter all right so let's go back to the main dot storyboard here what I'm doing is I'm going to select an object uh, which uh, for my image and uh, for a switch as well so I'm taking first of all image and dropping it here and I'm calling this uh, football image inside this all right and I'm taking one more guy to switch and dropping it over here so if I click the switch the football will start animate that's what I mean meant to do all right so I'm putting some constraints with height 32 of size Three constraint and it's a soft horizontal inside the container and let's make the switch more and constraint for this as well 20 30 all right that will make it no problem doesn't matter so here I'm going to my view controller for an assistant editor so let's make some space I'm going to go an out IB outlet for my switch as well. So switch button. And an IB outlet for my football as well. So control and track football image. I'd like to create an IB outlet for the switch as well. So switch, tap, right. Let's make this view control much more space for that everyone can see. All right, I'm taking out this one. And inside my view did load, what I'm going to do is I'm going to initialize the switch in off mode. The app runs, the switch mode will be in off. That's what I mean. So switch button dot is on. I'm setting it as false all right you can do this in the storyboard as well so inside the UI switch tab so I'm making an animation UI view dot animate with interval and animation so with duration I'm going to type one with animation 
self dot football image dot frame dot origin dot y will be minus or equal to 200 then I'm going to call one more guy here we need to stop this football as well so in UI view dot animate I'm calling animate keyframes with duration 1 with delay 0 0.25 so with options I'm going to set uh, dot auto reverse dot dot repeat and the animation I'm going to type self dot football image dot frame dot origin charge y will be plus or equal to 200 switch condition as well so if switch button dot is on so in case if it's on this animation will work all right I will add an else condition when the switch is off so else self dot uh, football image dot layer will be remove all animations here is an auto reverse repeat so i'm removing all the animation if the switch is off so before running with an mac os i'm first i will run an iphone and see what we have done so far all right my iphone and uh, here i have my switch initial at off stage if i switch on it will start animating this football if i switch off it finish all right let's come back to the main task of our project so here i need to run this iphone uh, mobile app in and mac os so what i need to do is i need to check this mac and uh, set it as enable and app category i will set it as business and uh, here i have my designation or the destination as mac my mac all right i will run this in my mac and see uh, for this uh, for you know in order to run this in Mac you need to have at least Mac OS 10.15 Catalina first my Mac OS app from iOS as you can see on the screen if I turn on switch on the button the ball will animate if I stop it will stop it that's it so this Mac OS app is right now in dark mode so if I want to change this into light I can go to my setting general change this to light see the difference right I'll go back to the dark mode itself so that's all in this video it's pretty easy and simple so in my upcoming videos what I would probably would like to do is to make a, make an Mac OS app with inventory so inventory app which is having all the stocks all these things you can add in a table view and we can make uh, inventory like somewhat a print which is uh, a bill like app so a complete inventory app that's what we are going to do in next episode that's with completely in mac os all right so that's all in this video thank you for watching stay tuned